Hey everybody, it's a Jim and Warren and you're watching Talking Vintage brought to you by Decades Reclaimed Vintage Depot located at 502 West Brennan Road, Lakeland, Florida, 33813. Welcome to the show. This is show number 96. I gotta start saying that earlier so that pops up when we're when we're posting videos and stuff. I have to wait for that number to pop uh, so I know which video we're okay. doing. Hey, let's talk about decades real quick. We are open seven days a week now. That's right. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. That is correct. Yes, we are open Sunday through Thursday until 3 p.m. and Friday and Saturday until 5 p.m. Um, let's talk about what's happening right now. Right now at the shop, we have the Santa hunt. If you come to the shop and you look around, you find a little Santa sticker on the back of a tag. That item is free. You can two two items per person per day, adults only. Okay. <clears throat> we also have our 50% off Christmas decor right now. 50% off all Christmas decor participating vendors. You'll see signs in the booth that say 50% off Christmas all over their booth. And you'll know that that booth is participating and that you can get those Christmas items for 50% off. It's Christmas items. It's not what you're going to buy for Christmas. You know, it's not gifts and stuff like that, but it is all the Christmas decor. Okay. Um, and then we have coming up is our year end red tag blowout clearance sale. I don't know exactly what it's called. So I say everything. And that is starts on the 26th of, has to be good. yeah, 26th of December. And I think it runs through the 7th. I want to think it's the 7th of January that it runs through. And it is a, uh, a tag similar to our Black Friday tag. There'll be tags on particular items and percentages off on those items up to 75% um, on individual items. And that starts the day after Christmas. Okay, today is uh, December the 19th. Yes, it is National Letter Day. National Letter, Letter Day, yep. Yeah. It's National Emo Day. Yeah, you don't know it, so we're just gonna go. But we're skipping that. It's National Hard Candy Day, I know and it's National Oatmeal Muffin Day. You're like, yeah, you might eat. Them. I'm not eating no oatmeal muffin. Uh, today's birthdays: famous people Jack uh, Gyllenhaal. Do you sounds, know him? Sounds familiar. And with he's a he's an actor. Oh, okay. Chris Angel. Do you know him? Nope. He's a magician. Oh, okay. Alyssa Milano. Do you know her? She was a yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah she was on Charmed. Day. Yep, um, and a whole bunch of other stuff. Um, who's the boss? I think is where yeah, she started. That's yeah, that's where I was going. Okay. Uh, now we're moving on. <clears throat> we're gonna play our game. It's called What's in the Box. I give Warren clues. He gets to guess what's in the box. If he guesses it wrong, he cannot guess again, and it goes to you guys to solve. Okay, he can't make multiple guesses either. All right, so small box unless you have a bunch of them. It needs to be a good box because these are fragile. They go hand in hand with a holiday and a fur, okay? They started in Germany in the 1500s. Christmas tree bulb. Ah. Close. They started in Germany in the 1500s by monks. It's up to you guys to figure it out now. Uh, modern ones are made of glass, plastic, cloth, just about anything. Um, I made one when I was in kindergarten. Um, I think my mom still has it. I think she puts it on the tree next to the one my sister made. All right, there we go. There we go. So if you guys know what it is, put it in the comments down below. Uh, we're going to move on. It's our show and tell time. Uh, we've got a box of stuff that we're going to show you here. That's from the shop. This is a... What's he made of? I guess he's he's a ceramic. Um, it's a little boy figurine with a lantern. And he is $7. We have a nice um, pottery vase with speckled little things on it. And um, it is $14. There you go. And then we have, um, oh, I, I had one of these when I was a kid, but I don't know if it was Santa in it. It's a little mug with a with a Santa figurine. Mine it's had something snowman. else in it. It's a snowman. A snowman, whatever. 
Um, I forget what mine had in it, a monkey or something. I can't remember. And, and this is this is five bucks. Gosh, I wish you could remember what that was. Uh, this is a, like a little, is it looks like a mold. Yeah. It's something you can hang on the wall. Um, and it's got um, pineapples on it and a, a little seashell and everything. And it is five dollars. And then um, we've got some kids books. Uh, these vary in price, um, but they're they're five dollars. And these are the little golden the golden books, little golden books. So uh, yeah, so all that stuff can be purchased at Decades You Claim Vintage Depot. Come on down if you want it or interested in it. Um, yeah, not saying it's going to be here when you get here, but it might be. Okay, vintage trends. Okay, what's trending, Warren? Oh my goodness! But obviously, we still got the Christmas stuff all over the place. The holiday is trending. Stuff. Yep. Can you For think sure. of anything else? Um, anything else is trending again? Oh, some toys. I think are still trending, aren't they? So much. Yeah, a little bit. Toys a little are, bit. Yeah. Are, are, are going, then the old standby animals. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Still, still. What's still not trending? Oh my goodness! What's not? Uh, vinyl records right now is not, <laughs> <laughs> not trending whatsoever. Yeah. Christmas ones, though, are holiday ones. Yeah, yeah, holiday, yeah, yeah holiday okay, albums are selling, yep. Yeah. yeah. All right, so there you go. That's what's trending, that's what's not trending. That's from decades. I mean, you know, the, the industry as a whole is different wherever you go. Um, so if it's not trending here, it could be trending there. And if it's trending there, it may not be trending here. All right, next segment we would have would be our vendor corner, but we've moved that to its own show. Um, so Talking Vintage Vendor Corner is its own show, and it's only on YouTube. So if, you want, if you're a vendor out there and you're waiting for us to help you out, go to YouTube, go to our page, and it's its own playlist. It's called Vendor Corner. Talking Vintage Vendor Corner it comes on every other Sunday at 8 p.m. So check it out. There you go. Enough said on that, That's right? Yeah, yeah. Um, joke time. Ooh. My favorite. What do you get when you cross an elephant and a kangaroo? Let me see. Earthquakes in Australia. Uh, oh, oh. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to give you another one. I hope so. Um, I've got a pen that can write underwater. Yeah. Yeah. It can write other words, too. <laughs> there you go. That was a All right. Hey, in closing, we want to thank everybody for watching our silly little show. We appreciate it. Uh, don't forget, Decades Reclaim Vintage Depot is open seven days a week now. Um, yep, with Sunday through Thursday, closing at 3 p.m. And Friday and Saturday, closing at 5, opening every day at 10 a.m. Um, you know, sometimes you could come in earlier, though, because, like, yeah, it, you can see. It's it's like 8-something, and we're, we're here. So, um, yeah, um, thank everybody for watching it. Don't forget that uh, Decades is having its Christmas sale, 50% off. Um, participating vendors on Christmas decor, and then uh, the Santa hunt is still going on. If you want to find a Santa on the back of a tag, that item becomes free, limited to two items per person per day, adults only. And then at the end of the month, we will start our big uh, year and blowout. clearance, blowout, red tag, whatever it is, sale will come at the end of the month. Hey, we appreciate you guys watching. Have a great night.